Question number 35. An unknown mass is on an inclined plane. The parallel component of the gravitational force is 600 newtons. So W parallel. So the magnitude of the parallel component of the gravitational force is 600 newtons. The perpendicular component of the gravitational force is 800 newtons. A, what is the weight? B, what is the mass? Welcome to hdtvedu.com. So whenever we have a mass kept on an inclined plane, the gravitational force always acts vertically down. Define your x and y parallel and perpendicular to the inclined plane. And then you will see that you have a parallel component w parallel and that is the same as wx. We are just looking at the magnitudes, okay? And then we have a perpendicular component of the of the gravitational force. So here is W, and so this is W perpendicular. All right. And don't forget. All right, and this is W X. And whenever we are given the horizontal and the vertical components. then the magnitude of the vector equals square root of wx squared plus wy squared. And so what is that? wx is 600 newtons. Wy squared is 800. So what do we get? Square root of, and that is square root of, and that is 1000. So weight is equal to 1000 newtons. If weight is 1,000 newtons, what is mass? Mass is weight in newtons divided by acceleration due to gravity. So what do we get? 1,000 divided by 9.8, 102 kg. So weight is 1,000 newtons and mass is 102 kg. And this is George Matthew signing off. Good luck.